Welcome to this aircraft engineered and today we're on the Airbus A320 and our mission today is to open the cargo door manually. So this is a two person job. So one person will come here and latch the door and then they'll come to the selector of uh, panel. So now that this setup is done, let's go to the uh, yellow hydraulic bay area. The yellow hydraulic bay area is located aft of the right periphering area. You can see the panel ground hydraulic yellow connection. So we open this panel. So this panel is used to service the yellow hydraulic system on ground. As you can see, we've got these suction and delivery uh, connections. If you want to pressurize externally the yellow hydraulic system, and then that's uh, the reservoir uh, depressurization valve. So, but for us today, we're looking for, the, for this hand pump lever and a hand pump. So the hand pump lever we can also use to service hydraulics that's uh, on the green service hydraulic uh, service area. So now we'll take out our hand pump lever and then connect it onto our hand pump. It's a bit tricky at first time to align the splines on the pump and on the lever, but I'll show you a quick tip. Don't worry, don't worry, I'll, I'll coach you on this one. So now let's move on to the next. So if you look down, you'll find this cryptic message from Airbus. I call it cryptic because it, it, it's not clear, but basically what it means is that in the event that you need uh, more leverage, uh, don't use an external rod or bar to poke inside the lever and try to make it longer, but use the, the, the extension. That's already provided in the lever. Yeah, basically that's what you're trying to say. I hope you caught me on this one. So, so the extension lever is actually inside. So you screw it out and then you screw the other end and voila. So the quick tip that I wanted to give you in connecting the lever to the pump is you look for the master spline and the ridge. So you see there's one thick spline and one thick ridge. So you just try and align those and it's in like that. So our pump and our lever is ready. So this is how I do it. Some you can connect the, the extension on ground, but what I normally do, I just connect it like this. Either way, it works out. So now my setup is ready. So the other guy that's next to the door will select the hand pump lever to open. Then for me, when I'm when he's, he gives me a thumbs up, I will start to pump. So while my colleague on the other side is holding selector valve to open, I will keep pumping until the door is fully open. So this is the procedure also when you are closing the door whereby they select the door on the close position and then you keep pumping until the door closes so that's our cargo door going up so we need to keep pumping until it locks in the up position so basically that's how we do the manual opening of the uh, the cargo door thanks for watching like and follow for more